Meanwhile, relations between North Korea and Malaysia appear close to complete collapse after Malaysia expelled North Korean ambassador Kang Chol. The move did not come as a big surprise as the diplomat had incessantly slammed Malaysia's handling of the case involving the death of Kim Jong-nam, the half-brother of the regime's leader. Kim Jong-su reports. On Saturday afternoon, the Malaysian government officially designated North Korea's ambassador to Malaysia, Kang Che, persona non grata, giving him 48 hours to leave the country and putting relations between the two countries in their most precarious state since they were formally established back in 1973. Kang had initially spearheaded attempts to gain custody of Kim Jong-nam's body when he died nearly three weeks ago. But as the Malaysian authorities denied those requests, Kang vocally disparaged the country's investigation and accused Kuala Lumpur of conspiring with what he called, quote, hostile forces. In response, Malaysia demanded a formal apology from North Korea by the deadline of February 28th. But with no such statement received, Kang has been told to leave. In connection with Kang's expulsion, Malaysia's foreign minister, Anifa Aman, said late Saturday afternoon that any entity making such misguided criticisms of Malaysia will face strong retaliation. Last month, a week after Kim Jong-nam was killed, Malaysia recalled its own ambassador from Pyongyang. And yet more fallout from the growing diplomatic role. Starting this Monday, any North Koreans wishing to enter Malaysia will have to apply for a visa. Last week, Malaysia terminated its visa-free travel agreement with the regime, which had been in place since 2009. The possibility exists that the two countries could end up severing official diplomatic ties completely. The general consensus being that North Korea would suffer the bigger loss if that were to occur. There are currently 1,000 North Korean nationals working in Malaysia under the visa-free deal, with many others visiting to seek business opportunities. Traffic from Malaysia to North Korea, on the other hand, has been consistently negligible. Kim Jong-su, Arirang News.